Aren't you scared of spending 500 million ADA per year? Um, no, not really. You know, first off, ADA comes in every year, so it's not 500 million. It's actually substantially less. Second, the value of ADA will go up. And so even if that's your spending, you'll run a slight deficit with a huge reserve for your first year. But then if you've done the money right, then the next year, uh, then even if you're seeing output in dollar terms is there, the actual ADA spend will be lower and it'll probably balance out with the inflow into the treasury. So uh, it, it, we, we will have failed as an ecosystem if everything stays flat, and we have such large outflows. You got to be bold. If we're going to win and actually make Cardano the number one standard, um, you have to invest as an ecosystem. And what's really crazy, if you say we as an ecosystem are unwilling to invest in Cardano with our own Cardano money, then why would any VC in their right mind come into our ecosystem? Ask yourself that question. Be honest about it. Why would any VC say, oh, yeah, I'm really excited about Cardano. I think I should invest in Cardano dApps and Cardano projects because they're going places when the Cardano community itself is like, whoa, 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 whoa. We think Cardano is going to be stagnant. So we have to like squeeze out this reserve for the next 150 years. Every block, every transaction, 20% goes into the treasury. You want the treasury to grow, increase the utility of Cardano. It's just that simple. It's an investment in the future. And if you don't think we're able to do that in our current form, then the project won't succeed. There's just too much on the market to compete with it.